you talk openly about your exes, I often write about my situations like that, like in music, and it's very therapeutic for me. Was it therapeutic for you? I, your music has gotten me through many a breakup, so thank you for oh. that. <laughs> <laughs> me too. <laughs> so thank you, you've helped all of us. Oh. Um, and yeah, I do think that this was, you know, just a cathartic situation because so much is said out there and sometimes yeah. there's not a lot of context. Or clarity, and, yeah. Yeah, and coming from a place of, you know, of a healing place. Like, I, I, I am past those things. I am healed. There's no anger there. So it's nice to kind of, you know, give context and, you know, tell a story that I know a lot of people have related to that, you know, these things happen and whether yeah. it, you know, sometimes they're not all great. And, you know, Instagram and stuff, you only see the good stuff. The so filtered nice versions, yeah. to kind yeah. of, you know, get into the real stuff and explain how you go from there to, you yeah. know, getting back to the good part. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. It's nice too because everybody is working through those same, we're all under construction, so it's very relatable. But I did hear this was pretty good. So you sold your wedding ring to help pay for your new house. Was that therapeutic? Because well, I love that. You know, Kelly. That's funny. I will say, so, when sometimes life gives you lemons, sometimes you gotta add a little vodka. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Amazing. I was trying to, you know, make the best out of a situation. Yeah. So, yeah. You, you I know, mean, what are you supposed to, to do? Keep positive. wearing it? Like, you know, I guess. Yeah. I, yeah. I think that's amazing. Yeah. You did something good with the money. <laughs>